What's up, Tim Sykes here. Um, teaching, trading, recording videos galore. Leave comments below if you want to get rich. Just let me know. Say, I want to get rich, or if you don't want to get rich, just say, I want to stay poor. It's totally up to you, it's not up to me. I'm gonna continue teaching everything that I've learned over 20 plus years. Um, I'm a little tired right now because today I was trading literally all day, filming nonstop. Um, I'm working my butt off for you. And this is why I have to ask you, do you want to be rich? Because it's a very simple question and yet some people might think they wanna get rich, but they actually aren't willing to do what it takes. Um, I give watch lists, video lessons, trade commentary, trade alerts, webinars, videos, software, websites, mentoring, Q&A, conferences. I don't know what more I can do. And I probably repeated myself twice in some of that list. I'm sorry. Like I said, I had a long day. I made about uh, three trades. I made about 1800 today. Um, trading with a small account in order to teach you the process. And that's what this is about. If you learn how to make 500, 1000, $2,000 in a day, it adds up over time. It doesn't matter where. Right now I'm in Beverly Hills. Next week I'm gonna be in Turkey and Bali and Israel and Japan. Um, I'm going all over the place. I'm living my life with my charity. I'm teaching students everywhere. And this is the freedom that I want for you, okay? It's not just about how much money you can have in your bank account. It's what kind of life can you build for yourself? You know, $1,800 in a day, I'm literally fighting with some, you know, penny stock promoters on Twitter. Like, I can't believe a multimillionaire makes like, a, a, on one trade, I made $180. And he's like, I don't believe it. Something doesn't smell right. Yeah, something doesn't smell right because, you know, he's a moron. Um, I show all of my trades. I teach with a small account because that's the majority of my students. It does me no good if I trade with a million dollar account and I say, hey, I made $20,000 today which I could do, but that would be bad for students. Why? A lot of people ask me that. Are you just jealous of the traders who make 20,000 a day? No, I've made $20,000 in a day. I made 50,000, I made 100,000, I've made 200,000 in a day. Those are nice, okay? They were very nice for me, they're nice for you guys. But at the same time, every single day, it's better that I trade with a small account because that's the majority of my students. They have small accounts. It helps to you know, understand the exact position size, the exact mindset. Because if you're trading with a million dollar account, it's very different than trading with like a $5,000 account. Trading with a small account, you have to be meticulous. You have to cut losses quickly. With a bigger account, sometimes, let's say for example, if you're short selling some of these penny stocks, you can average up because you know that these penny stocks are probably gonna come crashing down and you can afford to take, let's say, a $50,000 position or a $100,000 position and then just double up and then 200,000, 300,000, 400,000. I know some penny stock traders who are trading with like $5 million accounts and they make 20 grand as if it's some kind of achievement. All the little newbies, all the little poor people are like, wow, 20 grand in a day, I wanna do that. But if you try to do that same strategy with your small ass account, you're not gonna succeed. In fact, you're gonna message me complaining about it. And then I'm gonna say, I wish that you would have watched this video lesson that I'm making. Um, this is why I teach. I don't know everything. I'm not a perfect trader um, by, all, by any stretch of the imagination. You know, my top student, Tim Gratani, has made nearly double what I've made in half the time. Um, but I take credit for that and I'm, I'm proud of that. I want my students to do better than me. It's not just about me doing amazing. This is about you. Like I said, I've already had $50,000 days, $100,000 days, $200,000 a day. But when I make $1,800 and I show the exact process and the trades that I did were predicted in the watch list the previous night and predicted in the video lesson from the previous day, that's cool because the messages that I get from you guys who do follow my strategy, um, frankly, it's very rewarding. And for me, uh, this is about what fulfills me these days. You know, a lot of people ask me, why do I spend so much on charity? Why do I spend so much of my time? And why do I donate so much money? If I was living for time and money, I would not act the way that I do with my charity. Um, I live based on fulfillment. I live based on freedom. And I'm very proud to be able to do that. So what fulfills you? What would you do with freedom? Going back to my initial question, do you want to be rich? And some people say, oh, money doesn't buy everything. You shouldn't just focus on money. For me, money has bought my freedom. Money has allowed me to live my dreams, travel all over the world, and now teach, which is what fulfills me the most. I never knew this would be my future.
Never would have guessed it in a million years. You asked me 15 years ago, Tim Sykes, you're going to sell all your cars. You're going to go travel around the world. You're not going to care about luxury hotels anymore. You're going to get sick of these infinity pools. You're going to get sick a lot of the people that you meet, and you're going to just focus on teaching and charity. And I'd be like, what are you talking about? But life is funny, and that's what moves me the most. Um, and I'm fortunate enough to be able to focus on what moves me. So what moves you? And whatever the answer is, what comes first in order for you to focus more time on what moves you and fulfills you, you need to get rich. Getting rich allows you more time and more focus. It doesn't solve all your problems. Money can't buy you happiness, but money can buy you time and money can buy you freedom. And that's why I want you to understand how important it is that you need to get rich. If you look at a lot of the top people in the headlines, they're all rich. Okay, if you look at the most powerful people in the world, they're rich. If you look at some of the most fascinating people that I've met, it's not even that they have headlines or a lot of money, but they have time to do what they love. I met an artist in Santorini a few weeks ago. He has time to do what he loves. He paints. He's rich. Maybe he has a few million in the bank. It doesn't matter. He's not going for a billion. He gets to focus on what he loves. So again, I'm going to ask you very carefully. And I want you to leave a comment below. This is an important question and you have an important answer. Do you want to be rich? And are you willing to do what it takes to get there? I'm gonna include like seven free links under this video too. Um, not only do I want you to leave a comment, I want you to click those links. They're free, okay? This is how sure I am with my teachings. It's not arrogance, it's experience. I want you to learn from what I've seen over 20 plus years. Uh, I might not make the $20,000 profit days because I'm trading with a small account. I don't even put $20,000 into a trade. And I'm not going to make 100% on any trade because I usually take profits at 20 or 30%. I teach a very niche strategy that I can do in a safe way, somewhat safe way. You know, when we're trading penny stocks, there's always risk involved. But if you ask any penny stock trader around how I trade, do I trade aggressively like a gunslinger? Do I go all in? Do I use leverage? No, none of that. Joey, my camera guy, is shaking his head. No, he's learned. Trade like a castrated choir boy, I've heard you say. Trade like a castrated choir boy! Have that voice too! Seriously, if you trade like a coward, the stock volatility in this niche is more than enough. You do not need to go big. And trust me, when I say this, I'm trying to look out for you. Not because I don't want students matching my profits or, you know, overcoming my profits. Tim Grittani has made more than me. I'm very proud of him. But he can bet big because he has experience. In the beginning, do me a favor, trade small, okay? 90% of traders lose, but in the beginning, 100% of traders lose. You don't know what you're doing at the beginning. And that's okay. It's not a bad thing. It happens to everybody. You learn what not to do in the beginning. So trade small, lose small, manage your losses, manage your risk, but always be focused on the first question that I ask you. Do you want to be rich? And what can you do today, this week, this month, this year to be rich in three, five, seven, ten 10 years? Because if you have that marathon mindset, you will do things very differently. A lot of people don't understand the reason why I do things. It's because I'm living the life that I choose, not just based on how much money I make. I could probably live in New York, freaking focus on New York. New York has a lot more money than people in Bali. I could give seminars. I could teach all these, you know, rich a-holes and I could probably make more money and I would be miserable because for me, life is not just about money anymore. I got rich and now I have freedom. So I can go be in Bali and meet the kids who are now going to my schools that my charity is building, which I'm very proud of. We have 17 schools now in Bali, 54 schools around the world. My goal is still to build a thousand schools. So for me, if you ask me why I do things, I'll tell you. And you have to be very meticulous and really think about what do you want in this life. And mind you, that might change. For me, I wanted to take care of my family, which I've already done. I moved them down from Connecticut to Miami Beach. I wanted the nice cars. I bought every car under the sun. And now I've sold every car under the sun because they don't make me happy anymore. They're not as fulfilling as they were in the beginning. They're still fine cars, but I just have no need for them, okay? So have a goal, 
focus on achieving that goal and don't be afraid if you have to change that goal over time. This is tough for a lot of people. I know a lot of rich people, their only goal in life was to get rich, not to have freedom, not to have possessions. They just want to be rich. They wanted that label. They wanted that, you know, self-confidence. And guess what? Because they wanted it so badly, they made it happen and they got rich. And then guess what? They're miserable because there's no new goals. They don't know what to do in their lives. I know a lot of rich people. I know a few billionaires and they're not happy. And I know this sounds crazy to somebody who might have a few hundred dollars or a few thousand dollars. You're like, how can you not be happy if you have 10 million or 100 million? Because they don't really have anything else other than money, okay? You can have a lot of money and still be poor. And I know that's a foreign concept, but trust me, I'm learning as I go too what makes me the happiest. And it's not what I would have thought a few years ago and a few decades ago. And you probably will have the same thing. So I'm telling you this because I want you to get rich and then I want you to find yourself and find what makes you happy. But first you need to get rich because too many people aren't rich. They're working at jobs they hate. They're working for bosses they hate. They're inundated with school loans and debt that they can't get out of. And they're just trying to pay their bills. And they message me and they say, Tim, what you do, it sounds all well and good, but I'm just focused on living my crappy little life. And they're resentful. And I don't want that to happen to you. So I'm trying to get to you before that does. Hopefully, I can teach you. Hopefully, you can take advantage of these free videos. Why do I have so many free videos on YouTube? What's the catch? Because I want to teach you. And I don't want you to have any excuse whatsoever not to get educated. And then I have premium videos too. If you want to be serious about your education, you're probably not going to learn everything just from my free YouTube videos. I'll be straight up with you. I have a lot of videos, DVDs, webinars. A lot of it is premium. But at least you can see that I'm real, which is different than most people. You know, there's a lot of people just hiding behind the screenshots. They use fake names, fake screenshots, um, fake testimonials. It's crazy how disgusting my industry is. So for me, I might be exhausted, I might look tired right now, I am tired, um, but I'm gonna be real with you. And that's been the key to my success as a trader, that's been the key to success for me as a teacher, and it's always gonna continue. So right now, I'm into building schools and teaching, maybe in a few years, maybe I'll get so fed up with all these degenerate gamblers who never follow instructions and I'll quit teaching. So I would suggest you focus on learning from me for now, right now, while my heart is in it. I don't know how long it's gonna last, I'll be honest with you. So again, click some links below this video, take advantage of these free educational tools that I'm gonna give you. No catches whatsoever, just a whole bunch of free stuff that you can learn from. In case you have any doubts about me, it's free. No money risk whatsoever. Let's see your excuse then. And secondly, leave a comment below if you want to be rich, because getting rich is the key to everything else. Hey, Tim Sykes, Millionaire Mentor and Trader. Thank you for watching my videos. I hope that they help you. I want to share everything that I've learned over the years. You can check out more videos right over there. And also click subscribe so that you can watch all of these videos, get that knowledge, and become my next millionaire student.